I'm going to try this again. This rim is now set up way more than it was last time. I had to pop it back in because it totally opened up on me. It was too wet, too floppy. We'll see. I'm going to lift this out again and see and hope it maintains its form. Okay, it's looking so far so good. Um, now there is weight on the sides and it's going to want to s spread. I've got this joint here that I patch with a little bit of clay, this fold, so that it would hold together better. Um, and I'm going to, I patched that with fresh clay and you can see the color difference. I'm going to just touch that up with, uh, with the black slip again. Any of this clay schmutz, I gotta wipe that off and maybe do a little touch up. Uh, another thing I might wanna consider is the bottom of this piece, how flat is it? Let's see, it stands pretty well. It's not, um, and I wanna be really gentle and really lift it from here because the more weight I put here, the more it's going to go in and out and this joint is going to maybe want to open up. So I should be a little more careful. But I can also, uh, if I wanted to put maybe a foot to give this a little bit of lift, a foot on the bottom, I could grab a, I've got just like a pillow that's wrapped in plastic and I can flip it very carefully. I could even sign my name right here and slip. That would probably be a good, good thing to do if nothing else. But I may want to put a little foot ring around here and then I'll integrate that with the slip design. So I've got the bottom signed and I kind of touched up the little patch that I did here. I smeared it in a little bit more and touched it up with my white slip. And this is probably a good way for it to dry upside down. Uh, because it will dry more evenly um, and because that rim kind of has this joint where it wants to separate, if it's upside down, gravity is going to be working in the favor of the piece staying together. If, but only if it's upside down. So I'm just going to let it dry. Uh, I can let this dry pretty quickly. I'm going to leave it uncovered and it should be just fine as far as I know. This joint, I might want to consider that, and maybe I'll cover this section where I put this little patch. I'll cover that with a little piece of plastic so that dries a little bit slower because it is a slightly different uh, moisture content and maybe prone to, sl to splitting. Okay?